Okay, and that is Shield of Arrow completed. 9-2 beat me in the foot race here, like the little cuck that he is. That's going in the video, by the way. All right, I just caught 100 sharks just kind of chilling. That's 50 league points just there. 5,090 now. Eagle's Peak completed, so we can start working on Hunter. 43 Hunter off that. Baby Impling, five points, come on now. Okay, that's a medium task of catch 50 Implings in Pura Pura. That's 25 points. Two Sages Renown. I'm gonna stay here until I get 200 though. Okay, and that is 50 points for catching 200 Implings in Pura Pura. Let's get out of here. Unidentified Fragment, Harvesting. Oh shit, that upgrades my Chin Chonkers. I need to get that to 8k before I go to Black Chins. Please, please. Chin Chonkers, 5.9 out of 8k, let's go. Catch 30 salamanders finally done. 56 hunter now. Let's go. Unidentified fragment harvesting. That might be another chinny chonka. Yeah, it is. 6.6 .6 out of 8k. Let's go. 59 hunter. Let's go get a red salamander. Catch a red salamander. 25 points. Nice. Yeah, that's 63 hunter, which means I can go move over to red chins now, which is nice. Another unidentified fragment for harvesting. I assume this is going to be the chin chonkers. Yes. Okay, we only need to get two more of those to get to 8k. If I can get that before I get to black chins, that'd be great. But honestly, I think I'll just get it at Black Chins anyway. I should be fine. I'm gonna assume I'm gonna assume this is another Chinny Chonkas fragment. Yeah, it is. 7.75 out of 8k. As long as I get one more, we're chilling. Unidentified fragment harvesting. I think that is Chin Chompas completed. Is it? It is. 8k out of 8k. That's gonna be so good for when we get to Black Chins. Sorry, Maz. Okay, and that is a hard task of catching 50 red Chin Chompas in Candor, and the relic catches us two extra Chin Chompas now, so that's really, really nice. 5270 points. Now we're going to move over to Black Sally's and then Black Chin Chompers. Catch a Black Salamander, 25 points. Attack the guy at Black Chins, bro. Make him leave. Like, it is what it is. <laughs> it's a doggy dog world, bro. Sorry about that, buddy. Damn, reached 1250 total was a toss. I didn't even know I was coming up on that. Uh, what am I at? I have 370. Nice. All right, and this should be my thousandth black shin. Took me less than two hours to do this, honestly. I can't equip them just yet to cash in all those points because I'm literally not even 65 range yet. But we're going to go get that sorted now. 65 range. Let's watch these league points fly up. 5370. 5745. Equip 250 black shin chompers. Equip 500 black shin chompers. And equip 1000 black shin chompers. Just like that. Ran out of chins, got to 89, almost 90 range. Collected the crystal bow real quick. Obviously, we auto unlock some of the elves, so we just get that. Nice little 50 points right there. We're now at 5795. Five, five. That should be another quick and easy 50 points off completing the Sears Village Agility course. Enter the Wizards Guild, 25 points. We're Mystic Boots, another 25 league points. We're at what? 5945. Five. Oh my god, dude! I'm legit just getting fucking cucked. What a fucking sh- I can literally die on the next wave, bro. If I get one hit next wave, I'm quitting. I have one shark. Should I? I don't need, like. I want to go for the tank for hit. Jad's max hit is a 97. My HP is a 92. So there's a very low chance he hits it, and if he does hit it, I'm just gonna quit. So it is what it is. Okay, I survived the, uh, the hit from Tazok Jad without prayer. Nice. So contrary to almost the whole player base, I feel like I've never really used sound effects in game, but I was out of food and I was panicking pretty hard and I was really scared I wasn't going to get this done. To make matters worse, Jad spawned out of view so I had no idea what he was going to attack me with, just based off his animation. So Maz told me to put on my sound effects for the one time, to hear if it would be a range hit, and well, I didn't really have a choice. Guys, I need help. There's no way I can like lure him to where I can see him there, because he's right south, he's on the south boulder. Is it sound effects I should have on? Bro, this is gonna be cancer, bro. I'm gonna die. I'm not. I'm not used to sounds, dude. Will Blood Barrage work on Jad? Do you think at all or no? It's 
awesome. Am I gonna hit? This fucking bow is so bad, man. Holy shit, man. One elite combat achievement, one elite combat task. Uh, that puts my points up to 6,045. An unidentified fragment, too. Zamorokian Sight, I have no idea what that is. But yeah, I'm never doing a Crystal Bow Fire Cape again with these stats. I'm 90 range, actually. Maybe it's just this gear. I have no idea, man. But that was, that was, that was a different kind of stress. Another 125 points for just wielding the fire cape, so we're on 6170 now. Zamorakian Sight, bonus accuracy, damn. Sacrifice a cape. Alright, another 125 points. 6295 now, a little little bit of a jump. Okay, and this should be Chaos Fanatic down for another 50 points. Sorry, whoa, oh, 25 points, my bad. And it gave me 3k cash too, I'll take that. We are now at 6320. We have all, we also have 117 Sages Renown. Okay, it is time to unlock the rest of the skills. 30 points on Slayer. 30 points on whatever else I have. I think that was Herblore. And it's going to be 20 points on farming. So yeah, it is it is what it is, boys. It is what it is. Okay, unlocking Herblore auto and completes Druidic Ritual and gets you to three Herblore. So that's nice. And the last skill to unlock is farming. I will have 37 Renown points after this. So I should be fine, honestly. It should be all good to go. Potion done. 26 Herblore. I thought it was going to get me 39 too. Okay, and that should be Merlin's Crystal completed. We're working on the Piety quest line right now. Luckily, we're not going to have to do Shiloh Village because we can auto-unlock it. Okay, and this should be Holy Grail completed. Should get me to what? 64 defense, 61 prayer. Okay, can't use chivalry just yet. Oh, I'm doing fishing contests right now, so I thought I'd just make a quick pit stop at the fishing guild because I should be able to just get a 50-point task or a 25-point task just from entering the fishing guild. Yeah, nice. Fishing contest, five points. Okay, I'm going to unlock Fremenic 2. I'm not going to unlock Fremenic Exiles. I don't have the 50 points to spend on that, but I am going to spend 30 points on unlocking Royal Trouble and everything that comes with it, which is Royal Trouble, Lunar Diplomacy, Fremenic Isles, Throne of Miscellanea, the Fremenic Trials, Shallow Village, Hero's Quest, and Dragon Slayer 1. So it's very, very nice. Let's unlock it. Okay, and we have unlocked... Oh, completed the Throne of Miscellanea as a 25-point toss, just like that. And completing Royal Trouble is a 25-point toss, just like that, too. Damn, so we just got some Sages Renown right back. We're at 6400 now. Use the bank on Jatizo, 25 points. Use the bank on Nezi for another 25 points. I'm also going to buy a Helm of Nezi. Okay, 50k for a Helm of Nezi, but that's another 25 points. We just jumped up to 6475. Catch a Salmon on Karamja, 25 points. Scene of Interest completed. 25 points just like that. Would you like a new Slayer toss? Nah, not from you, bro. Uh, 28 Slayer. We are now at 6530. Alright, let's get a toss from Vanika real quick. 17 Cave Slimes. I think that's two toss right there, yep. All right, three lamps or so. I'm just going to dump this into Herblore. So when I do one small favor, I can be 30 Herblore for the... What's it called? So I can be 30 Herblore for the reward. 39 Herblore. And this should get us all the way to 42. All right, I needed to get some herbs for... What's it called? One small favor. Clean of Grimy Gom is also one toss right there. Let's go move on to one small favor and cash in those fatty XP lamps. Wearing full green dehyde is a task, I'm pretty sure. I couldn't do it earlier because I didn't have Dragon Slayer 1 unlocked, but it's been auto-unlocked now, so yeah. That is 25 league points for equipping a full dragon head set. Okay, and that is one small favor completed. Two antique lamps, which are going to give us some fatty XP drops. 142 Herblore takes us to 55. Takes us to 60. Nice. 60 Herblore, just like that. One small favor got me to 60 Herblore. Okay, this is Black Knight's Fortress done, so I think we can move on to King's Ransom now. Harvesting Fragment. I unlocked the Rock Solid Fragment. What's that? Okay, and that is Anakra's Lament. I have no idea how to pronounce that, but it is 50 points. It's a hard task, and it gives us a fuck ton of XP. 59 crafting, 55 mining, 55 fire making. Nice. And that is King's Ransom completed 33,000 def 33, defense XP. Sorry, 71 defense. Now nice. And an antique lamp, which we're just going to put straight into Herblore. 62 Herblore now. All right, and that's the Night's Wave training ground completed. 1 mil XP, 73 attack, 74 defense, 80 strength. Two fragments, too. All combat fragments with this tier have reached their maximum level. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. So I got nothing because I have all fragments. I see. Okay, and this should be 25 points for activating chivalry. Nice. 6645. Let me just chef up this rabbit real quick. Nothing against you, man, but you are free 25 points. Cheers, bro. Okay, let's finally defeat a water fiend, which is actually a hard toss. 50 points right there. Trap a saber tooth kayak. 50 points just like that. Yo. 25 points from unlocking free use of the blast furnace. And that is 125 league points for cooking a dark crab. I am 59 cooking, but the relic that just auto cooks food for you 
actually allows you to do that toss. So that's pretty cool. 6920 now. Easy crumb to toss done. Let's go get this XP lamp. Farming. Ooh, reach base level 5, reach base level 10. There we go. We're now at 6975. Cook 100 lobsters. Now at 7,000 league points. Let's go. Catch 100 Karam one. Done. Let's and that is cook 100 Karam ones. This relic is really nice. I haven't even finished uh, the Taibana Treyo quest, but the relic lets you cook stuff, so that's pretty sick. Just got a production fragment, too. 6.7k out of 8k in the Dine and Dash. Nice. Unidentified fragment. Harvesting. Let's go. The Slash and Burn fragment. Let's go, man. That Getting Slash and Burn is huge for us because now we have the three relics that unlocks the Unchained Talent, which basically gives us a level 8 boost in every single non-combat skill. So I can do all the tasks that are 8 levels above, like as you can see right now. I have 67 out of 59 woodcutting. Uh, 57, 67 out of 59 crafting. 71 out of 63 woodcutting and stuff like that. So I can go push out a bunch of tasks now. Did I do it? Complete the Prif Agility course? Damn it. I need to do the other one. Surely this is the 110. Surely. Yes, let's go. I don't even know what just came out of my mouth, but let's go. 50 points for completing the Prif Agility course in a minute, 10 seconds. We're now on 7205. Dissect 50 Sacred Eels, 125 points. 7330 now, and I have 73 Sage Renown points too, bro. They're trying to tell me a message. Okay, it is time to say goodbye to the Bodhi number amount of Sage's Renown points. We are going to unlock Karen 3, which is Kingdom Divided and everything beneath, beneath it. Tale of Righteousness, Ascent of Arceus, Forsaken Tower, Death of Despair, all this bullshit. I don't know what any of this quests are. I've literally never done them, but except. And we just got a bunch of points putting us up to seven. That put us all the way to 7430 points because we just completed a bunch of tasks from doing those quests. All of those quests. Friends of Hasidia. Bro, I'm not even reading them all out. That was like nine quests, but yeah, we're 70 points away from tier six. Cost, Resurrect, Superior, Ghost. Medium toss for 25 points. Cool. All right, all right. this is going to be hype, bro. It's Sinister Offering. It's, level, it's the most bottom right. All right, all right. Oh, get up. Let's go. Tier 6 unlocked. And now Maz is going to surge my ass. So there's a bunch of points just locked behind GP. And one of the best ways to get GP is from Revs. Now, with the Tier 6 Relic, let me just show you what's up. Fragments, maybe? Perhapsingly, yeah. Passive effects. Tier 6 now means that items from some sources will be three times as common. I didn't want to really farm revs for money until I had this, as it would have just been inefficient. So now when I get this, uh, now when I kill revs, it's going to be the best GP possible. Receive a Slayer Toss from Neve slash Steve is 25 League Points. I didn't even know that. Let me assign myself revs. Oh, he doesn't assign revs. Who assigns revs? Oh, shit. Reach 1500 total level, 50 League Points. Let's go. 7655. I should, I should keep one of the room plate legs, right, for the task? Yeah. Looking out at the chat. Room plate legs. Yo, I just got a room plate body, so I can do that, uh, I can do that rune task later. Nice. Oh, yo, I got four uncut dragons done. Should I keep them all nine too? Okay, we have been here for a while. I'll probably put a loot tracker pick of what we got from Raz, but we have five mil cash from just all the alcables. Be nice, please. Don't worry, don't worry. It is time to get gaming and it's time to go get some points. First thing on the order of business is to buy a fuck ton of chaos runes because I'm gonna go get some taco. Okay, three mil spent just like that, but we have over 30,000 chaos runes now. Do I have my Karamja gloves on? I do not. Let me get those on and let me buy some taco. Okay, this is how I am getting my taco. I have my shift click set to cell 50. I'm on resizable for the first time since the last leagues and you literally just spam click between the two like this. Okay, I sold all my Chaos Runes for about 360k Tockel. Still have around 2 mil cash if we need to buy some more. I basically just want to destroy the gem store and get to 82 crafting. So what I'm going to do real quick is I'm going to unlock... Okay, another very costly unlock, Sins of the Father for 31 renown points. But it is worth it because I want to get the Draken's Medallion just to make banking easier. Let's do it. And that completes a couple tasks for us. A medium and a hard task, a Taste of the Hope and Sins of the Father. Giving us 75 points. We're now at 7730. Let's go collect this Draken's Medallion. All right, I've spent like, what? A lot and lot of Tockle. I've got all these gems. I'm just going to start cutting them up into uncut gems and then into bolt tips as well. My hope is to get two of the fragments I'm looking for, but I also have to do this for the crafting XP anyway. Unidentified fragment. Miss, please be the crafting one. Rogue's Chompy Farm. What? What? Bro, I'm almost I'm almost done crafting and I think I just got it. Drag on a bit fragment. Yeah, I literally just got it. Um 
This still doesn't unlock the full uh, set for me. I still need to get like a fletching relic. And yeah, I've almost caught all my gems already, but hey, doobie what a doobie. Okay, I got 60 fletching and I still haven't unlocked the relic. I'm just gonna go ahead and carry on uh, doing the gems. I think I just don't think it's worth it to keep trying to get this relic. Just got a production fragment. Imkando's Apprentice. Okay, that is the final thing we need for the... I don't even know if I said that right. That is the final thing we need for the auto crafting. I'll show you guys it in action right now. All right, peep this, boys. Just like that. Yep, we should get to 82 very quickly now. Okay, this should be 82 crafting. I am very low on Talkle now. I do need to buy a bunch more Chaos Runes and sell it. Luckily, I do have two mil for that. But now that we are 82 crafting, as soon as we get these Chaos Runes and Talkle, this 7.7k points are gonna fly up. Okay, we got 322k Talkle now. It's time for the points to start flying. Buy an uncut onyx that is an elite task done 125 points putting us up to 7855 right now i'm just pickpocketing one of these tazaras trying to get the diamonds and with the smooth criminal relic or maybe yeah i think it is the smooth criminal relic i literally don't get hit back at all i can just spam click them until i get this diamond i have the ice gloves on so i'm not going to get hit at all pretty sick i'll just spam click it until i get this diamond hopefully it doesn't take too long i think it is one in 195 i'm not sure if the drop multiplier does anything to that or not but shouldn't take too long 347 pickpockets later, and we got the diamond from the Zazar task. I just choked on my words. 7980 points. Nice. All right, we can't buy too many of these. I'll come back later when I have the GP, but I think this should be a task here. Yep, that is a 50 leagues point task right there. So we're now on 8,030. I'm going to sell it back as well. We'll come back here later when we have more GP. Okay, let's cut this onyx, and let's make the right thing here, or this could be really, really awkward. All right, craft an onyx amulet. Let's do this. Surely that just gets ball of walled up. Four and another elite toss, another elite toss, 8155 now. Dragonstone amulet as well. I think that's a 50 point toss, so 8205. I told you we're gonna be flying. Look at us go, we got a fury. And that is pickpocket of Vire 50 times for 50 points. Well, it's, it's a hard toss just to do floor one. Okay, that's floor two done. Another 50 points. This is the last floor we can really do, I think. Oh, what? I can't even do it. I'm boosted. It doesn't work. Damn, that's so cringe. Damn, that's cringe, dude. Why didn't I get any, uh... Oh, but I can't buy anything, huh? Damn, I just got 50 points for activating two set effects. I didn't even know that was a thing. 8405. Let's get an imbued mage cape real quick. We're gonna take the imbued zami one, and that is 50 points right there. Gonna wear full rune, too. We've been saving that for a while. That's another 25 points. 8480. Let's keep flying. We need some GP in here. 72k... Damn, Alchemaniac is so nice on that. You, get, you only lose 8k on the staffs. Enter the Woodcutting Guild, 25 points. Another 25 points from chopping some logs with the Rune Axe. Building a Waka Canoe, 25 points right there too. Okay, and that is 50 points for just going past this uh, Agility Shortcut. Base level 20, 25 points. Okay, let's make an Oak Larder. This should be another toss done. Yep, another 25. I think I just got the Construction Fragment. Plank Stretcher Fragment. Yeah, let's go, nice. Build a mahogany portal is another 25 points. 8,680 8, now. Defeat some defeat some animated rune armor, 25 points right there, nice. Move your player to own house to uh, Yanel, should be a decent amount of points. That is 25, yep. Relocate it to uh, Polnavit should be, what? Another 25 points? 8,755, 5, just like that. Oh shit, oh shit, I missed one, I missed one. Move it to Relica. Your house has been moved to Relica. Another 25 points. 8, 7, 80, 95 Sages Renown right now. Okay, I don't have the cash to get much more farming levels right now. I could go do Tithe Farm, but I CBA right now. Base level 30, 25 points, 8805. Bon Voyage unlocked. Oh shit, you get 25 points just for going to Fossil Island. Say less. Should get a toss for building a bank here too. Yeah, just five points though, but we're now at what? Um, 8835? Okay, building a Magic Birdhouse, 50 points right there. Very nice. Okay, and that's setting up a U bird house, which is another 25 points. 8, 9, 10 now. So Lunars. Oh shit, it does. What the hell? I just got 50 league points. Nice. Craft of Rune using Dale Essence is 50 league points. Damn. 9,010 now. We're over 9,000 points. Over 9,000. I think if I use the bank here as another medium task, yeah, 25 points, 9,035. Jeez. This should be another task here for crafting 50 Astral Runes. Yeah, 50 league points and another three Sages Renown. 9,085. All right, let's build a little medium stash unit. Um, 25 points off that? Nice, 9110. Use the abyss, five points. 49 rune crafting too. Craft 50 nature runes, 25 points. 
And that is craft 50 cosmic runes, another 25 points. Craft four of four, what is it? Craft four runes with one essence, 25 league points, and 50 rune crafting. This should be craft a lava rune or craft any combination rune, so that's 50 points in total, 9 to 40. And I think there is a task to make a fire rune too, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, there is. So I'm now at 9, 2, 4, 5. Okay, there should be like another 25 points, I think, for making a body rune. Oh, and that's uh, to craft 200 essence into runes as well, so that's 50 points in total. 9, 2, 9, 5. Make an air battle staff in the wilderness for some reason is a task. 50 points, 9, 3, 4, 5. And that is another 50 points for burning 100 U logs. 9, 3, 9, 5. Wield Willow Shield, that's 5 league points, not bad. And that is Fletch 50, Maple Longbows, and Candor, another 25 points. Okay, and that's crafting 50 Law Runes. 9, 4, 7, 5 points now. Alright, should get 30 points from doing this. Check in my task for 5 points and equipping a lit bug lantern for 25 points. Nice, 9505. Alright, I probably should do some of the Dorgish and quest line to make it a little bit cheaper, but I am just feeling unbelievably lazy right now, and I have a lot of renown points. Hopefully I don't come to regret this. Let's unlock the Dorgish and quest line, which completes the Lost Tribe and the Death of the Dorgish, which gives me 50 more league points. 9555. Let me buy a Dorgy real quick, because I'm pretty sure I do get some points out of this too. 25 points again, nice, 9580. Okay, that's a bullseye lantern already, I'm pretty sure. Light a bullseye lantern, 25 points like that. Uh, what are we looking at right now? 9605. That is steal a diamond from Dorgish Khan, which is another 50 point task. 96,000, 96,000, 9,655. Okay, and that is serve 20 pizzas in the mess hall, which gives me 50 points. I'm now at 9,700. This guy was a trim completionist in RS2. Damn. What the fuck? Nice. And that is serve 20 stews in the mess hall for another 25 points. 9,730 9, now. Shit, unidentified fragment, miss? Message in a bottle, bro, what a troll. Reach combat 100, let's go. That's 50 points right there. 9,780. I'm gonna stay here until 99 mage too, and hopefully I can get this uh, prayer relic, but probably not knowing my luck. Okay, and that is 99 magic, 125 league points right there. 9,905 points, less than 100 away from the big 10k. Uh, where is it? Slayer staff, use Slayer's enchantment on Slayer staff. I'm pretty sure this is a... Oh, wait, maybe I have to wield it? Yeah, 50 point task right there. Damn, 9955. Grab an assignment from the boy Duradel. Should be a 50 pointer right there. 10,005 points. Honestly, don't even have to assign herself a task. That's crazy. Over 10,000 points on the Shattered Leagues in under three days. Build a hard stash unit, search a hard stash unit, and that is another 50 league points for filling a hard stash unit. 10.5k. 10.05k. Take some super compost, 25 points right there. Cost fertile soil, another 50 points right there. And is there a moon clan telly on this spell book? Surely there is. Nice little combo breaker of points right there. Uh, another 50 points for costing that. 10,180 points now. Alright, let's buy this one. Wield it. That is 50 points for equipping that. Okay, we're 7k points off the next one. I'll be shield. We've been flying up the ranks every single day like I said I would. Slow and steady wins the race. My boy 9-2 is in first place right now with like 14k points. By the time this video is up, he's probably already at 15k. But we'll be catching up in no time. Trust me. 5,000 to 10,000 points in one video. I will see you guys tomorrow. Leave a like if you enjoyed and subscribe if you are new. We're so close to 100k. Please help me get there. I will see you guys later.